All right, people have always told me, you need to read Animal Man by Grant Morrison. It's some of the best comics ever. And that always scares me because, like, when people say that, they're usually talking about, like, Neil Gaiman or uh, <laughs> Alan Moore. or And I, I tend to not like those comic writers very much. I think they're pretentious. Uh, I think they undermine comics as a medium. And I think their, like, dark, edgy storytelling style is not... Uh, all that good. So uh, I got into this. Uh, the beginning I really liked. It, it was a six-issue miniseries where this Animal Man character comes back from the Golden Age. And this has standard 80s art, which I really like also. Um, and he's uh, got the power to just, like, copy animal superpowers who are around him. Uh, and it's pretty cool. And he fights this, like, environmental fight to start. And it's really nicely done. And uh, I really enjoyed it. Um, and... Then it gets into some weird stuff. Like, they start killing off his family. They start talking about, like, these uh, people who are outside the universe who are kind of controlling everything and continuity. And it becomes this, like, uh, meta take on comic books. And, gosh, that annoys me. Um, I mean, I, I get that it really wasn't done at this time here, and so it's something different. But uh, I found it very difficult to get through the end of this storyline as it really didn't conclude with any sort of like happy ending or like good ending for the character. He literally just meets Grant Morrison and Grant Morrison kind of just like derps at him. And I thought it was uh, overrated and pretty lame towards the end. And I, I really hate those kind of concepts. I think they destroy superheroes when they do this kind of thing and uh, just make them uh, kind of not that interesting as characters anymore. It's very sad. So that's what happened through this uh, dark ending. Not very interesting stuff. This covers uh, all of... Uh, his Animal Man run, Grant Morrison's here. And so you get the full complete story, which is kind of nice. Like I said, uh, ends on kind of a sour note there. All right, I give this like a six and a half out of 10 with seven being my kind of like average scale. I really think this was not that great and people have overhyped this to hell. Probably gonna get a lot of flack in the comments for this, but I don't care. This is what I thought. Leave a comment with what you think. Hit that like and subscribe button. We'll be back soon. Uh -huh.